welcome back to my channel Chloe V Mummy of Three and welcome back to another grocery haul. Saturday we've just been swimming that's why Lily has uh, wet hair. Um, yeah we should have drone, drone? We should have dried your hair a bit more in the changing room shouldn't we really because it's so cold out. Uh, Mum fail there. Right so I said the kids could have something from the bakery because we're going to Lidl if they're good. So are you going to be good? Yeah. Excellent yeah. stuff. Um, I might not do a lot of filming around the shop just because I think I'm running out of space on my phone. I've got a few vlogs backed up. So um, yeah, I will catch up with you when we're back home, show you what we've got and let you know our meal plan for the week. Mommy. What are you going to choose? You can have a pink donut, or you can have a jam donut, or a chocolate I donut. Back where it's I don't know. Sorry. Pardon? I don't know. Just pick what you want. Don't worry about what people have put back. Are you going to get a toffee yum No, you can get one thing. You're going to get a toffee yum yum, Zach. Mm. What do you want, Lily? I don't know. You like donuts, don't you? Donut or the cookie? I don't know, it's a hard choice. You want a chocolate donut? No. No? What do you want then? So, for anybody who needs a dairy free selection box, they do them. £4.25. No, you can't get that in a. Well, it's only a small selection box, but they do them in a little. Got tree chocolates. Penguin. Guys, look, there's a cute penguin. Uh, penguin with a chocolate in. Got chocolate coins. Would you? Oh, look, gingerbread chocolate bites. Oh, I bet they're interesting. I bet they're nice. Yeah. Got a big loaf cooking down there. Mommy, I really like toffee yum yum. You need your toffee yum yum, do yeah. you? I need one of them. I've got yeah, hazelnut baby, and almond baby, stars baby. of cinnamon. I bet they're yummy. I don't even know what those are. You don't like loaf cooking. I like them. And they've got shortbread, biscuits. I really want these. Christmas coffee, if you want Christmas coffee. Nice Christmas butter biscuits. £2.50. I think we're probably going to be spending quite a lot of money on, a, on the shopping this week, Lil. We've never seen these before. Marzipan fruits. Don't touch them, Lily. I bet they're nice. I love marzipan. You wouldn't like those. Oh, and this is just my favourite. Chocolate covered marzipan. We've got Aya Christmas cakes, little panettones, and there's a big panettone over there. If anybody wants one, what are these? Mini meringue bites. Gosh, your kids would like these, wouldn't you? Oh, yes. <laughs> Can we get them? No, we're not. I'm not doing the Christmas shop yet. Right, come on then. Cheese advent calendar. This is $9.99. Those are macaroons or macarons. macarons. And then they've got little wheels of cheese Ooh, here. Wednesdale, I'm sure cheddar. Or smoky cheddar, I love smoky cheddar. They've got a mature cheddar and mozzarella chorizo cheese bake. £5.49. So we are home from food shopping, and here it is all behind me. £87 worth of food there. It doesn't really look like it but you know let me know when uh when i go through it what you think of it and they've got quite a few frozen bits actually and to get some meat um so yeah i think i did all right but but yeah it's just oh, it's just all so expensive isn't it at the moment i'll quickly run through my meal plan with you and as i'm saying that realize that what i've got out what i'm wanting to do for dinner tonight i'm not gonna be able to do for dinner again if i don't get the bloody meat out so where's the meat we are, this is what we're having for dinner tonight. I'm gonna to make a cottage pie. This may have to go into the microwave on defrost setting to defrost it, I think, because I don't think it's gonna defrost in time because um because it's so cold and just cold. So we're gonna have a cottage pie tonight for dinner. Tomorrow we'll have chicken casserole and mash. Another night we're gonna have chicken wraps salad and the kids can have beans and things with it, figure out what to put with it. Um I'm going to do beef burgers with homemade buns and some couscous on the side and again like baked beans for the kids with theirs or something. Um, another night I'm going to do spaghetti and meatballs. 
meatballs. Um, I've just bought meatballs because that's for Wednesday evening and Wednesday is always quite a rush really because we've got some um, not swimming, dancing for Lily. Um, Thursday, fish finger sandwiches slash baguettes. They had no baguettes, like part baked baguettes in Lidl. So I might have to pop out and get some instead because they're nicer than a bit like sandwiches. And then Friday we're going to have pizza. And there's a reason for that and I can't remember why. I don't why. Oh, because we're putting the Christmas tree up, so I'm gonna be something quick and easy. That's why. This is all the shopping, and I shall go through it with you now. And I also picked up the little um, Christmas brochure. I've never had a little Christmas brochure before, so I'll have an interesting look through that. I'm sure Gareth might make a little list and see if he prefers the stuff in Lidl or in Aldi. Because um, he's made his list for Aldi. It's not actually as much in here, I don't think, as the Aldi one. But there we go, I've got that in store now anyway, if you want to pick one up. Okay, so I'm going to start with the frozen stuff. So we got four beef quarter pounders for one of our meals. Um, I forgot to get burger cheese, never mind, I'll have cheddar with ours. Um, what I will do, I'll just take a little bit of mine and Gareth's burger off to give it to Lily, because she doesn't ever eat a full burger. I, last time she ate some of it, um, but before she hasn't, so she's still not eating like a whole burger, so I'll just give her a bit of ours. I got four chicken steaks because I'm going to put these in our wraps because they had no chicken goujons in Lidl. None that were a decent price anyway. They had like a tiny bag for £3 something. There was no way I was going to pay that. Um, I bought these 15 omega-3 fish fingers only because they didn't have any like of their Simply range. So they were £1.69. Um, I needed some fish fingers for our fish finger baguettes in the week. Um, potato waffles because Lily's just had the last one and she said she wanted some more. I bought these crispy skin on fries which is so nice from Lidl. So I've got those. The kids won't eat them but me and Gav like these. And on the night where we have pizza, I've got one pizza in the freezer. So we're going to share that. I'm going to have chips with it and salad. And I bought some more sweet corn because we will go through sweet corn quite quickly because it's the main veggie that the children eat. So let me pop this away and then I'll go through the rest of it with you. I said I'd try and remember to tell you the prices of things and I forgot with that lot. So the burgers were £1.99. The chicken steaks were like £1.69, I think. The sweet corn was £1.39. What else have I got that's frozen? <coughs> oh, the fish fingers, they were £1.69. I think I did say that. I think that's it. I'm not sure if I've missed anything. The rest, um, this Cien Fragrance Free Body Lotion. I don't know, I think that was just under a pound. Um, the dishwasher salt, which I really needed. I'm so glad because I didn't take a listing with me. The only list I had was the list of stuff I needed for dinners. Um, so I'm glad I remembered this. And that was one ninety nine. And I like buying it from Lidl because it's in a cardboard thing so I can recycle it. Um, I bought some more cling film and that was pound eighty nine. So it looks like there's quite a lot though, 75 metres, so quite a lot there. Um, then I bought these biodegradable multi-surface wipes because I like to give the bathroom a quick wipe down every day. And those were 99p. And then the double toilet tissue or jumbo rolls, they were £2.39, so I just grabbed some of those. Um, I picked up a cucumber, which I think is 79p. And then a family bag of peppers and they were £1.55. Um, I don't know if we've got peppers left in the fridge still. Oh yeah, we do. Okay, so we need to be we need to go heavy on the peppers this week. We need to eat them. Um, I've got two bananas. I'm not sure how much they were. Um, they're for Lily. And then I got red cedar scrapes, one pound sixty nine. The purple organic fruit pouch and the red organic fruit pouch. They're still two pound seventy five each. I got the not from concentrate orange juice, a big one. Oh, thank goodness it's no bits. I thought I was going to say with bits. Um, that was £1.99, so I didn't think that was too bad. Um, the chocolate flavour milk, that was on offer for 99 p The pineapple slices for Zach, they're £1.9, and he likes those. And these are quite, they're a bit bigger than the ones in Aldi as well. You get a bit more in there. But they do cost a bit more as well, so. Um, <clears throat> peach slices in, like, syrup, 34p. Then I got these cinnamon squares, which I really like. I think they're £2 something. And then, oh, gosh. The kids and Gareth's favourite cereal, chocolate hazelnut pillows. They, Zach picked these up, so as long as they haven't changed price, they were 2 09 the last time. Um, I think the six pints of milk might be £2.55. Not so sure, I'm just guessing. Um, one, I think is £1.50 for these blueberries, but I liked the packaging and I like blueberries, so we've got some of those. Rayburn apples, they were 99p on offer this week. I don't know how much the carrots were, I just picked them up. 
I imagine they're about 40 odd P. Um, again, baked beans, just the cheapy ones. They're about 28p, I think, for a can. And I got some chocolate spread, and that was £1.49, I think. Uh, baby plum tomatoes, these were on offer for 79p. I got some, I remember cheese this week because I forgot it last week, but I didn't need to buy any. We may do. Um, £2.55, I believe. And £2.49 for cheese strings for Zach's lunch. Gareth sometimes takes one to work. Um, Greek style strawberry yogurts. I love the peach ones, but I couldn't see them this week, so I had to pick the strawberry ones up. They are £1.69, I think. 12 meatballs. I think those were £2.19. What I am going to do, though, is just make them into smaller meatballs, I think, so that there's like just a little bit more on people's plate. Um, just smaller meatballs. And then chicken thighs. And these, I did, did um, pick up the thick. The blah, blah, blah. I can't speak. Right, I did pick up the fillets, but they were five pound um, for a bigger pack than this, admittedly. But still, I wouldn't have been able to get two full dinners out of it for us all. Um, whereas these, because they're bone in, are cheaper, like two pound sixty nine or something. So that'd be brilliant for our chicken casserole. And um, yeah, I don't mind eating them like that. Neither do the kids. Um, got cheese pizzas for the children. I'll add more cheese to it and probably put some treats so that I bought on them as well on Friday. They'll have it with a stick of garlic bread. But these are 55p each. And they're quite they are quite thick ones. So they're, they're nice. Um, three things of garlic bread for the children. Um, 37p each. They're like a good side for dinners with Fussy Charlie. Um, bagels. These are 85p. So I picked some up. I really like bagels and so does Charlie. Um, I think the chocolate chip brioche rolls were like £1.9. Got those for Charlie and Lily. £1.49, I think, for the croissants, because Zach is liking those for his breakfast right now. Um, I didn't actually check the ingredients on here. I think they all seem okay. Um, and then cooked ham, 85p. Simply chicken breast slices, those are £1.99. And 99p for some chorizo, which the kids all love. Um, dark chocolate, I think that's for about 43p. Roasted salted cashews, which I think I'm going to have some of now. They were 95p. More expensive than peanuts. I've still got some peanuts left, actually, in the cupboard. Yes, I do. Although Claire from Mum Things said that the peanuts in Aldi had gone up to £1.15 for a bag. Which seems a lot. Um, Hartley's jelly. I can't remember how much that was. And I've bought branded. I never do that. I probably paid more for that than I would have in Aldi. And if I look at my receipt, I'm going to be annoyed. I know that already. So I might not just look at my receipt and then I won't be able to be annoyed. So I don't know how much that was, but I can guarantee you it's more than I would have paid for it if I'd seen the thing. Um, right. <clears throat> White toasty. That was 75p. Um, I think the wraps that I bought, because I'm going to use these for one of our dinners. I think they're 99p. I bought some yogurt slices. I think they're £1.9. I'm going to have these for my breakfast before I go to work. Um, two things of fajita seasoning just to keep in the cupboard. I like the ones from Old oh, Lidl because they're no artificial colours, preservatives, no MSG, no hydrogenated fats, blah, blah, blah. So they're like 39p each. Um, these Neo bars like Oreo dupes are little packs, individual packs in there. Two packets of those, the snacks for the kids, I think they're 79p each. And then mini jammy wheels, Charlie and Zach like these, they are 99p. And then I got some Canyon bars. So they're just caramel chocolate bars. £1.9. And then Charlie really likes chocolate covered rice cakes. Excuse me. Oh, you all again. £1.49 or £1.59 for these. And I like these as well. And you get three in a pack. Um, so I just like split split them, give him one in his lunch, whatever. Um, milk chocolate raisins. And those were 95p, I think. About a pound. And then I got four bags of crisps, and I don't normally do this, but the ingredients on them are good, and I don't always like the ingredients on the ones in Aldi. So I got prawn cocktail, because Lily likes those, so just Charlie. Um, two salt and vinegar, because they're Gareth and Lily's favourites, and Zach likes cheese and onion, and I will eat anything apart from those. So um, I don't really eat crisps either. But yeah, so that is that's the shopping. They're 99p each as well, so I thought that was quite good. So, yeah, that all came to £87 something. The only thing we need to buy in the week are the part baked baguettes, which are just pennies, and um, some milk, and probably, well, definitely more bread. Always need bread and milk. So, yeah, I hope that you've enjoyed this food haul, and um, I think I got a decent amount of stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. Back, back comes week of floorboards.
Oh, look, now. Now that I'm trying to do it, I can't get it to do it. Oh, there we are. There we are. Oh, honestly. If you have enjoyed this food haul and you're not already subscribed, please give me a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.